Well, back in the Nightmare Badlands by where we fought the, uh, Dark Rise, so let's switch to this Relic Song door, shall we? You. Alright, what is here? That was Deoxys. Hello? Well, I did not capture him because I completely forgot I'm out of money. And I need to buy more balls and repels. And the fastest way to make money is actually doing these dumb races. Yes, 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 come on. I, I don't care what Pokemon I use, it doesn't matter. This Regigigas, the slowest Pokemon I have. Icy Path. Icy Path is the easiest one to do. Let's go. This is like the easiest way to make money. And go. Like, I don't think as long as you're competent, you can lose this this track. And you can finish it in like 30 seconds, so... I think it's like 30 seconds to make 10 grand. It's a, it's a pretty good deal. Like, uh, I think I've lost this maybe five times. And by lose, I mean come in second place. Because the NPCs just get caught in the ice. They literally can't do anything else. First place. Man, that was rough, right? 26 seconds. 26 seconds, 10k. I like that money. Yeah, yeah, give me my money. Give me my money. I want my money. 11k. Not bad. That's some ball money right there. Be right back. Oh, right, back in the Holland Desert, I figured... While we're here, might as well go ahead and catch some Delta since I had to buy some balls. Let's see, where is the rock climb spot? Is this the spot? Feel like it- oh, I'm stuck. It's quicksand. Alright. Hello! Ooh, rare candy. And there's Reggie Sand. Delta Reggie Rock, discovered by Lucy85. Being made of sand, it can easily replenish itself and, in some cases, ward off water type attacks with ease. Nice. Alright, let's go get another one, shall we? Actually, how the hell do we get out of here? I think I assume a lot over here. You. Where does this go? Oh, right back up here. Alright. Alright, back in Lake Holland. Let's head down here to the dive spot. Alright, is he in here? Let's see. I think he's in here somewhere. Where we encountered him the first time. Ah, there you are. Save. Hello, Reggie Water. Delta Reggie Ice, the ocean Pokemon. Lucy 85 again. Though its entire body is composed of water, it is unable to alter its molecules to the gas of it or solid. Interesting. Okay, we're back on Holland Mountain. Let's see what's hidden in this door here. Uh, Relic Song. Oop. What do we got? And the answer is. Is that Hoot Hoot? Oop. I think that's Hoot Hoot. Delta Hoot Hoot, the Snow Owl Pokemon. A booty! Its ears are sensitive enough to hear a snowflake fall upon the snow on the ground from across the forest. Okay, we're back in that cave that we uh, used rock climb to access a few episodes ago, back in Holland Mountain. And I finally found the button I gotta press to get the Pokemon. Let's see, right over here. Boop. Press it, yes. Something happened. But what? But what? Oh, I'm an idiot. That's what happened. This opened up. Doi. Oh, flashlight. Give me flashlight. God, I'm so happy I found that flashlight. So happy. Okay. Uh, there's a Tesseract spot there. I guess I'm hitting that. Boop. Tesseract. Oh, we're going back in time. Alright. I, I can dig that. Is it the puzzle? That's up here. That's been up here that I can't do anything with. Aha! Delta Elekid, the statue Pokemon. Though it tries to remain as still as possible around humans, it cannot withstand heavy rain, causing it to flee indoors. Alright, alright, and there is Delta Reggie Steel, next to the power we caught Delta Ramoraid. Hey buddy. The Crater Pokemon. Once again, Lucy85. Its emergence from the pools of magma is said to be blinding due to its core glowing with extreme heat. Oh boy. Alright, let's start soaring. Let's see, where the hell am I going with this? Oh, there we go. Oh, bingo bingo, right there, actually. How do I... How do I get inside the portal, though? Do I gotta be perfectly... Oh, there we go. Perfect. Bingo bingo. That is how you do it. Save. Hello there. Delta Hoopa, the breezy Pokemon. Discovered by Terra Terracotta. The clouds produced around its torso allow it to remain in the air, even while it's asleep. Fair enough. Look at that glitch, Jesus Christ. I hope I can land. No, land, not safe. 
Okay, I just thought Reg uh, wait, Krauser here, Thunderbolt. Because you need a Pokemon with a, an electric type attack for this thing over here. These little uh, lightning rods. Okay, and you gotta basically fight things. You fight things with Thunderbolt until C-Dot appears. Uh, basically, Delta C-Dot. You gotta kill things with electric type attacks around the lightning rod and that'll appear wildly. Of course, I just killed by mistake, so I'm not capturing it. Be right back. Alright, and down these stairs in the same area. Think in these trees, maybe? Gotta find it. No. I'm hitting the right key. Maybe here? Somewhere in these trees. There we go. Dun dun dun! Hello. The Seda Pokemon. It's a powerful goat like. Oh, it's powerful goat like legs allowed to scale steep mountain walls with little to no difficulty. The fairy type. Alright, back in the hall and grasslands. Let's go ahead and catch some deltas in here now. Can we buy the Manaphy statue? Small opening in the trees? Yes. What is in here? Save? Hello? Delta Maywild, the enticing Pokemon. Let's go by. SP mission? Spy mission? Spy without a Y? I don't know. Luring foes with its innocent and sweet appearance. It devours them and sends nutrients through the vines at its head. Jesus. That's pretty dark, actually. Okay, this was a combi earlier, now it's a Mothram. Let's fight it again. Hey there, bird. Unpheasant. And then you come back one more time for this baby. Hey, you. Battelle. The angel Pokemon. Shadows. Shadows of me. It gracefully descends upon wary travelers, restoring the morale and energy in the process. So you get that, you basically, you talk to the combi, then you go inside a house, you come back, you talk to the Mothram, house come back, it's a bird then, house come back, and then finally it's a pet tail. That's how that works. Yep, yeah, but again, the full moon? Don't know how to trigger that. Okay, so I figured out this Delta Carol Blast thing. It's actually tied to the real life full moon cycle, so... And it's only between 9pm and 4am. So what I did is I set my computer clock to December 2nd, 2017, full moon day, and dun 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 dun, the sweet Pokemon, Bradley in a box. For no reasons, this Pokemon is extremely friendly towards Shelmet. Indeed. Okay, so back in the desert, apparently there's an a this is an arrow pointing to the right, and you want to go right here and use dig, I think. I think that's how you want to do this, dig. Can't use that here. Alright then, never mind. That's not. Oh! Okay, yeah, there you go. You just talk to the wall instead. Problem solved! Hello, Mystical Cave. What's in here? Hello? Hello there. Delta Baneri. A Delta species is by Nico. He uses his techniques to rob the weak, causing his parents to scold it constantly. Okay. Okay, we're back in the hole and marsh. Time to go. I believe I put honey on a plant here. I gotta check. I finally remember to do that. So let's go check that out. Okay, there's a big tree here. Oop, can I headbutt the tree? Yes, I have a headbutt. Go. What do I get? A delta species is governed by Hex. Foes reared by its tentacles are slowly drained of their strength while succumbing to the poison. Was not expecting 120. That was a surprise. That was an honest surprise. Okay, now now to remember which... Oh, okay, it's that one right there. Yanmar. Sapphire Phoenix. Though it specializes in camouflage, it is also known as a great flyer, capable of quickly chasing down a prey. Nice. Oh, there's a path here to the east. Where does this go? Looks like I can surf here. That's the save button, not surf. There we go. What are we doing down here? What area is this in? What the hell is that thing? Hey. Delta Gumi, the soft mud Pokemon. Let's go by chosen username. Its body is mainly composed of mud and extremely squishy when touched. Sounds like it's fun to touch. Okay, there's a Tesseract spot in the middle of the forest. Wonder why that's here. Alright, where the hell does this go? Okay, there's a Manaphy statue at the far southwest end. Let's hot swap there. Okay, now where? You guys just follow this path? I'd assume so. What's that? Light clay. It's, a sh it's shit, that's what it is. It's shit. Alright, so does Polidus. Hello? Anything special here? I assume this is going somewhere good. Hey. Delta Froki, the jungle frog Pokemon. Yubadot! The leaves around his neck ke help keep its neck warm while jumping through the trees at high speed. Looks like it's got a little leaf mustache. It's cute. It's cute. 
Okay, we're back in Lake Holland. Apparently there's a, there's a dire spot to the southeast area I never noticed, so let's dive down here, so it's down here. Never found this spot, so I'm not entirely sure what is down here. Oh god, there's a lot of rocks. Oh Jesus Christ, there is a lot of rocks. Oh my god, oh boy. Well, this is gonna be fun, isn't it? I can just cheat my way past that. Okay, well that was easy, I suppose. Hey you. What are you? The Ocean Snake Pokemon. A booty again. They usually form small colonies in the midst of raging seas where they are protected from predators. Looks cool. I like snakes. I like Snivy. Why not a water Snivy? Oh, there's that Pokemon again. Hey little guy. Okay, you fly so far I found him at the northeast corner. Uh, northwest on top of an island, and then down here underwater to the north again. The northeast cave underwater. Let's go find him some more. There he is again. Hey, little guy. That is just north of the entrance to Holland Lake. Oh, he's, uh, here he is again, that place where he fought Reggie Ice and Reggie Water. Boop. Goodbye to you. That's five times. Also, while we're here, let's go in that mysterious cave with that Pokemon I can't capture. Apparently... The trick to this is this little dive spot right here. I didn't see that. I don't think anybody saw that. And then this goes in a cave in here. A cave within a cave within a cave! Where's the dive spot here? Right there, I think. Yep. And there he is. What do we got? Delta Magby, the snorkel Pokemon. Yubadatien. Though it is a water type Pokemon, it is incapable of breathing in the water and aims to hold its breath longer every day. Okay. Alright, and there's that little guy once again in that place before we, we went to with all those rock, uh, rock climb things. It just looked like a barren place with really nothing in here. Hey, little guy. Fight me. Let's go. That smile on it is actually kind of fucking creepy. Uh, no name dummy. Made from sand, the shell is back hardens as it floats along the ocean surface. As it dives, the shell softens. Tell me that smile does not look creepy as hell. Just honestly tell me that. Okay, if you're confused about where we are, let me just definitely 100% show you. Once again, it's that little grotto area on this island right here in Holland Lake. This one right here. There you go. Alright, we're finally back in Holland Volcano for the last bit. Uh, I think it's right over here. There's that Relic Song door we couldn't go get up before because we didn't have Relic Song, and now we do. So, where is it? Up here, maybe? Yeah, this feels right. And then I think it's to the north in here. Yeah? Yeah? There we are. Relic song me. Here we go. Alright, and what is behind this door? Hello? Delta Venipede. Delta species is covered by Dank Rabbit. It is highly aggressive and will attempt to set its surroundings on fire when agitated. My kind of Pokemon. I think that is all the Holland Deltas now. Alright, we're in Rogan Town. I think I'm going to take on the final challenge of this game, probably. Let's see, where's the rock climb path? Is it what I'm wondering? Is this it? This feels like it could be it. I'm walking to a wall though. What is this? This is where I came from. No, that is autosave. Fuck, okay. Is there a rock climb thing in here? There is. Huzzah! Into the wall, blue yonder. Hey. So many crazy things to do here. The battle tower, the battle pyramid, the tube challenge. I hope, I hope to try them all. I'm gonna be the strongest trainer ever. Uh huh. So which one of these things is the tube challenge? That's what I'm after. The tube challenge. Bingo bango. Northwest corner. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Hey, you? Yes. Fortunately, I cannot let you pass. A tube pyramid is required to venture on. From the challenge championship, I think on your first victory. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Fine, we'll do that shit. Let's go. I'm only really interested in the tube challenge. Truth be told, I don't like the battle frontier. Never did. What is this? Battle Factory, no. Is this the championship? Yes. Okay, so I assume I won't be able to use Regigigas or anything. Am I right? Oh, can I just use my whole team? Well, that's good. The place where the strongest trainers gathered to compete. Please choose- okay, so I can't- Fuck. Band, band, fuck me. Alright, Volcarana. Regigigas. Nightmare. Or, yeah, Nightmare. Yep. 
Confirm. Welcome to the Challenge Championships Tournament. Today we have eight very eager contestants waiting to compete for the title of champion. Let us turn our attention to the scoreboard to see who will be competing today. Without further ado, let the match begin. Koi vs. Blue. Alright then. Thanks for playing. What? I... What? 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 Okay, the second time it actually let me do the tournament, it was just old gym leaders. So, can I get the pass now, please? Pass, give me the tube pass. And the novice rank, I don't care about that. There we go, that's what I wanted. Alright, let's go take that on. Yay. I guess I just don't like really, really like the Battle Frontier, because it's got all the stupid format of rules that competitive battling has, like, oh, you can't use this Pokemon, can't use these items, etc. That's just not for me. Everything seems to be in order. Good luck. Alright, tube challenge. Let's do this shit. Do I get to heal up midway through here? Or is this just like a onslaught that I don't get to heal up from? Welcome to the tube challenge. Just do the best you can. Plan two. What is your name, madam? Ranger Becca. Uh, well... This is- this is kind of unfair to you. A little bit unfair to you. Also, this really ain't much of a challenge when you're 40 levels lower than me. What a fun ma no, it was not. You were 40 levels lower than me, your entire team. What the hell is this? Is it- I thought this was supposed, uh, supposed to be like YouTubers or something. You can't blame me for taking a challenge as easy as this- uh you're not bad at Like, seriously, what is the point of this? You're all super weak, and I don't think you're YouTubers. Hey? I'm the strongest bug type trainer around these parts. You won't stand a chance. I think I will. I got beat. Fair is fair. This is stupid. This is quite dumb. Hey? Bohal, I'll crit you at every attack. You're going down. I'm really not. What a competitive, no luck, all skill match. 40 levels higher. 40 levels higher. I've been preparing for this for ages. Let's do it. Let's do it. Well, dang. Next time. There's no next time. Alright, next idiot. Hey, you. I'm not gonna talk trash before the match or anything. I'm just anxious to get going. Uh-huh. Maybe I should take my time. Maybe. Maybe this should get- maybe this should get a little bit harder, huh? You'll never make it to the end of the challenge. You lose here. This ain't challenging. Well, dang. Dang indeed, friend. Dang indeed. I had to throw my glass of fuel up berries because I'm running out of PP. Only a few more to go. Can you make it all the way through? Probably. You're all weak as hell. You won't make it much further. Is this supposed to be a challenge? At all? Hey? Don't blame this win on hacks. I'm gonna bring you to the ground fair and square. Right. Fair and square was pushing it. Uh-huh. How about you, Granny? The spirits of the doom will assist me in your defeat. Uh-huh. I just want to show you the caliber of training I'm battling right now. Level 84 Polywag. That's th that's what I'm doing in my life right now. That's what's happening right now. That is this entire dungeon right now. I was lied to. So was I. Trust me, so was I. Hey. What's good? You don't stand a chance. Uh-huh. Lost again. Once again. Yay! And you. No talk. Bring it. Uh-huh. Oh, for crying out loud. Yeah, my sentiments exactly. You look like a fat Lucio, by the way. I appreciate it. I'm the final trainer here. You beat me and you get to fight the Arena Master. Oh boy, what are they gonna have, old 90? Not bad, pass on through. Okay, Arena Master, let's do this. What do you got? Oh. Okay. Do I... Do I just capture you? Oh, okay, this is actually a legit fight. Okay. Oh, okay, it's level one... So we go from level 80s and 90s just, just straight up to level 100. Okay, I I appreciate that. Let's let's do it. Probably gonna die from that. Fair, 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 fair enough. Of course, I'm just gonna bring out Mewtwo up his fucking ass, but still, it's the thought that counts. Go Mewtwo, whip him out, whip him in the shape. I mean, psychic. Got one psychic left, just enough to kill it. And boom shakalaka. Do it. Do it. Boom. I win. That was rough. 
There you go. What now? Hey, little guy. So, are you mine now, or gotta capture? Because I gotta capture? Alright. Go let. Well, Delta go let. Scubbed by Runeblade. It battles in arenas every day, honing his skills in the hopes that one day he'll become a champion. That's a cute little guy. Nah, I'm good. So, that's it then? Just, I don't think there's anything else here. Well, that's the tube. I was told the tube challenge was supposed to be like YouTubers. If those were YouTubers, I never heard of them. Like, I'm not dissing them, they are YouTubers. I just, myself, have never heard of a single person in that cave. More power to them, more power to them if they are popular. Just don't know them. Uh, well, there's probably a few more legendary left to get in this game, and I don't know what else, so... Like, okay, I've taken out the- I've taken out Dev Island, I've taken out the Battle Frontier, at least what I want to take out of it. And I've caught the legendaries that actually matter. I don't know if there's really anything else for me in this game, to be honest. I may make one more, just for some random shit. But, if not, we're back tomorrow with a different game. Thank you for watching, thank you for liking and subscribing if you did. Not, just thank you for watching the videos, I appreciate you for watching. Will I come back tomorrow? Probably, in all honesty, a new game. In the meantime, I'll see you then. Bye, Zs.